No, we have a channel where we do dawa and then some people, it, it, it usually encourage other people to, go, to, to come to Islam, okay? You may have, other people might have the same questions and basically... And then when they see it, they are motivated. And then okay, so it, and you will also get a reward for someone using you as a means to come to Islam or get closer to God. And whatever good deed the person does in life, it will always be duplicated for you as well. So, all right, <coughs> your name? Dami. Dami. Dami, where do you, are you originally from? Um, my parents is from Nigeria. Okay. All right, so my name is Abdullah. He's brother Muhammad. He's brother Muhammad as well. Uh, brother Akil, and we are in Coventry in our Dow stall. So, is anybody? So, I want to make a, some small statement before we go on. Is that all right? Yeah. So, our brother here has come to speak to Brother Muhammad. He's convinced that Islam is true and he wants to accept Islam. So, we want to ask him some few questions because people have misconception that we Islam Muslims are forcing people to accept Islam. So, Islam demands that we request. We ask this question before we proceed. Is anybody forcing you to accept Islam? Are you doing it out of your free will? Are you convinced that there is one true God, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, who deserves to be worshipped? Are you also convinced from your mind that Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, he is the last and final messenger of God? Do you believe that the Quran is the last revelation of God? God has sent many revelations the Torah, the Angel, and other scriptures, but Quran says is the last revelation. Do you believe in that? Do you believe in all the messengers, including Jesus? Okay, I will say what I have just asked you in Arabic, and you repeat. Okay? Ashahadu. Ashahadu. And la ilaha. La ilaha. La ilaha. La ilaha. Illa. Allah. Wa ashahadu. Wa ashahadu anna muhammadan abduhu wa rasuluhu. I bear witness that there is no deity worthy of worship except Allah. I also bear witness that Prophet Muhammad is a messenger of Allah. I also bear witness Jesus is a messenger of Allah. I also bear witness all the messengers who came before Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon them, are all messengers of Allah. Atakbir. Allah. Alhamdulillah. MashaAllah, you are a Muslim now. MashaAllah, welcome. So, what we normally do is Bismillah. MashaAllah. So when someone accepts Islam, what we normally do is we give him some information and then we also help him so that to look into what the person is supposed to know in Islam and how to go about Islam, okay? And Alhamdulillah, our brother, they, he actually teach people who are reversed. So he will take your number and add you to the WhatsApp group and then he, we will contact you to give you further information. Is that okay with you, yeah? Uh, he's accepting Islam in a way, alhamdulillah. So, so come closer here, alhamdulillah. My name is Mohammed. You said your name is which one? Dami, Dami Ibrahim. Dami Ibrahim. Okay. You can also, uh, is Ibrahim your name or Dami your name? Uh, Dami is my name. Okay. Your, your father is Ibrahim. Okay. Okay, it's fine. What you, we normally do is, uh, do you know the meaning of Dami? Is it a Nigerian yeah. cultural name? Okay, it's fine. Okay, what we... You may find out the name first. We wouldn't press about the name, but you can find out the meaning of the name. So when the name is something that is associated with idol worship, we normally encourage brothers to change the name. Okay, you can adopt a new name. So it doesn't... If you have this one, you still can change it. It's not an issue. But if it doesn't, I uh, have any idolistic way, uh, meaning, you still can keep your name, okay? We will give you a Quran, we'll give you how to start, you know, prayer, step-by-step -step guide. 
and then other information, but he will also give you more information when he contact you. Is that okay, yeah? Okay, come. Now. Alhamdulillah. Yeah, we'll talk about that. We'll talk. <coughs> after, after uh, we will tell him what. Yeah. <coughs> <coughs> Any supplication or prayer that you make now to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will be accepted. So right now, if you make supplications for us, for right us now, so, yeah. we will really benefit from, from you. Yeah. If, that, if that makes any sense. Does that make any sense? <laughs> Whatever like a, like a, yeah. Like a, yeah. So. Like what, what he is trying to see is, if somebody accepts Islam like the way you have accepted Islam today, you are like a newborn baby, someone who had no sin at all, and anybody who had no sin and so pray to God, God accept the person's prayer immediately. So we normally say that, remember us in your dua when you are praying. So the next step I want to encourage is, we know that we are all, we are grown-ups. So when someone accepts Islam, there is a step, a middle step that we need to show you to take a bath. This bath is called purification because you might have been doing other things without knowing any purifying yourself in an Islamic way. So we will show you how to take the bath. Basically, at the moment, we can show you all the details, but if you go home, you can take a um, shower, but in your, when you go into the shower and you clean your private pass, and then <coughs> before you start, you make an intention that I'm going to take the bath of purification in your language or in English language, make that intention and then wash your head three times and then wash the rest of your body thoroughly until you are satisfied that your body is clean. No soap, no, you don't use soap. So and when you do that, that aspect of the head is taken out of you. And then we can now go forward to other things. Take this one, this is the English version of the Quran. Huh? No, no, don't use soap. Yeah. Purification bath, no soap at all. If you want to take um, use a soap to bath, you, if you want to take soap, use soap, you will first use the soap to do your normal bathing. When you finish that, put the soap aside and use only water to do this particular bath with an intention to eat, okay? Yeah, remove the hairs. Remove the hairs. No, 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 you just clean them, you just wash them, yeah. Uh, just wash them. Hmm? No, you're a student. Yeah, but not the same. 